keen on DIY? Use this life hack compilation to make your crafting easy. Make your back to school supplies in style. Has your glue dispenser dried up? Is it impossible to collect the remains from the bottle? Make it easy and use a glue spray. Pour stationary glue into a spray bottle. Dissolve it with water in a one-to-one -one ratio. Put on a spray top. Shake the solution. The glue mixture is sprayed out in a thin layer, sufficient to attach paper elements. This practical life hack lets you use the entire glue that's left over and keep your hands clean. Another spray idea is DIY spray paint. Squeeze acrylic paint into an empty spray bottle. Put in the same quantity of water. Shake the bottle to mix the water with the paint. The sprayed paint creates a wonderful pattern. You can use this hack to make scrapbook paper. We've used it to decorate clothes. Are your pockets always stuffed with school supplies? Then you'll definitely need this functional organizer. Take your old denim shorts out from the depths of your closet and give them a second life. Turn your shorts right side out and cut out the front and the back sides. Decorate a frame back with fabric or paper. Fold up the edges and hot glue. Attach the shorts parts overlapping each other. Assemble the frame. This amazing fabric picture is both a unique decor article and a practical holder. You can put your school or crafting supplies in it as well as notes. And what is more, you shouldn't worry about stretching the pockets. Do you like original stationery? We'll show you how to transform boring wax crayons into a multicolored one. Put wax crayons into water to remove the labels. Hold them there for a few minutes. Now you can take off the paper easily. Break the crayons and put them into a silicone mold. Melt it in a microwave. Remove the multicolor wax crayons shaped as a cute heart, a funny teddy bear, and a little star. It's a simple craft hack that actually works. Use this unusual wax crayon to make a smooth transition of colors or create a rainbow effect. This thread and yarn gets tangled all the time. When the yarn gets unspun again and again, you may lose any inspiration for crafting. We've got an idea on how to solve the problem. Attach a piece of masking tape to a glass jar. Draw a big heart. Cut out the outline with a modeling knife. Remove the excess, keeping the heart attached. Decorate the jar with tissue paper. Fold it a few times. Draw a heart. Cut out with scissors to get a heap of the same elements. Make hearts of different colors. Apply stationary or white glue onto the jar. Attach the hearts in a paper mache style. Apply the glue on top. Attach the details in different directions, overlapping each other. Alternate the colors. Cover the bottom. Cut out the tape heart with the modeling knife. Remove the detail. Work on the top. Make a hole in the center with a big nail. Put a ball of wool into the jar. Pass the thread through the top hole. Put on the top. Your yarn won't get tangled anymore. The hearted jar will keep the ball safe and clean. Are your thread and cord remains scattered around? Use this little trick to organize your working space quickly and easily. We'll need wooden clothespins. Fasten the thread end and wrap it around a clothespin. Wind the thread around its coils from bottom to top and secure the other end. You can store any kind of thread or thin cord in this style. They'll never get tangled and you'll always have on hand the spool you need. Are you into bold painting experiments? Create a stunning abstract picture from wax shavings. 
Sharpen wax crayons of different colors. Choose bright contrasting colors. Place the shavings on cardboard in a random style. Cover it with parchment paper. Iron it. Let's see what we've got. Wow! You can use this fabulous abstract painting to make a creative wall centerpiece in your room. Are you going to a birthday party? Craft a non-standard handmade gift, testing a glitter and hairspray life hack. We'll need a piece of black cardstock. Score a line across the center. Use a ruler and a sharp wooden stick. Fold along the scored line. We've made a smile template on a separate piece of paper. Score the outline with the sharp end. Paint the teeth white. Cover the lips with white stationary glue. Sprinkle with big glitter. We've chosen a royal blue color. Shake off the excess. Fasten the glitter with hairspray. Attach a wish note inside. The smiling gift card looks totally awesome. The recipient will be absolutely impressed to have got this amazing DIY present. This gorgeous gift card has inspired us to create a phone case decoration. Let's make it in the same style. The lip color may be different, but we like this weird combination so much we want to use it again. Start by painting your phone case black. Use acrylic paint. If your case is small in size, place the smile horizontally. Make sure to fasten the glitter with the hairspray or clear nail polish. Cool! Apply stunning makeup to match your sparkly phone case and go straight for a photo shoot. Is there no space for a pencil cup on your desk? Make a hanging holder to keep your pencils in. We'll need knitting threads of two contrast colors. Take a few strands of each color to make a cross knot. Tie it in the center. Make simple knots using neighboring threads. Repeat for the second row. We've got a net pattern looking like a flower. You can continue weaving to make a net of the appropriate size. Put a container in the center. Tie all the threads together. Thread a big bead to embellish the holder. Fasten it with another knot. Cut off the excess. Put your pencils in and hang the holder whenever you want. The hanging school supply organizer is a smart decision if you lack desk space. It won't turn over, scattering your pencils all around. You'll enjoy using it. Experiment with thread until you're satisfied with the colors and pattern. Do you like drawing with color pencils? Then you need to sharpen them quite often. A plain glass jar is a clever way to keep your desk clean and tidy. And it stops pencil shavings from scattering around. Make a hole with a big nail in the top of a little jar. Make it wider with a pencil. Hammer on the underside to smooth the edges. Spray paint the top. When dry, hot glue a sharpener to the underside. You won't have to clean it upon each pencil sharpening with this spacey container. And even when the jar is full, it'll look like a stylish decoration on your desk. Have you ever tried to draw with a battery on a phone screen? No? My friend doesn't seem to know about this trick either. To disguise the battery as a stylus, we've decorated it with sparkly tape. And who can tell now that it's a plain battery? Your friend is impressed. This life hack works perfectly. The battery can draw any image or write any word. The lines are defined without excess pressure or vain attempts. It's perfect for girls that have long nails. We hope this compilation of crafting life hacks will help you organize your working space in a clever and practical way. Use this compilation in your DIY projects to make a new awesome collection of school supplies. Hit the like button if you liked the video. Write in your comments which tricks you use in your crafting activity. Be sure to subscribe, ring the bell, and be among the first to watch a new video.